All right, guys, I'm back. I busted up, opened the box earlier, and I had a lot of glare coming from my camera, so I restarted the video. Um, but we have 9899 Series 1 Finest. And what I was discussing was you can figure out there are 75 Centurion refractors of each player. There are 20 cards in the set, and you have the pack odds. So you can figure out the roughly the pack print run and how many, like, say, Mystery Finest Jordans that were produced. And I crunched the numbers, and you guys can do it too, but I came up with, like, roughly 320. So 320 of those Jordan Refractors, um, Mystery Finest, um, be 320 of the Kobe Jordan and Eddie Jones Jordan. But they go for, like, 100 to $200, something like, like 100 bucks for a card that has a print run of... 320? I mean, that seems crazy cheap. I know they're double-sided, but uh, those might be worth looking at, into because to me, that's just a bargain right now. But let's go ahead and open into these packs. Oh, we had a jumbo as well on that box. It was a Antoine Walker non-refractor. First pack. We have just oh, we have a hardwood honors. Still haven't pulled the MJ. That's like the second or third Robin, David Robinson I pulled, and those are not quite one per box. Uh, you can pull Centurions, the hardwood honors. Mystery Finest, the Base Refractors, the No Protector Refractors. I think that's about it as far as the better cards that you can pull. These cards are, like every other one is upside down. I don't know if I've ever had that before. The box seal is fine. Packs look fine. place here. Let's flip this around. So no protector Jawan Howard. Kim Olajuwon. base in that. So yeah, if there are really 320 cards roughly of that Jordan Mystery Finest Refractor, gosh that's a steal at 100 bucks. If you guys can find them. There's not too many on eBay, like the ones on eBay are PSA 10 so their buy it now prices are pretty high but if you can find a raw version. Um, we pulled one raw on a previous video of Eddie Jones and Jordan Mystery Finest Refractor and it was in good shape too. There were one in 144 packs or 100 and something like that, 133 packs. <clears throat> uh, we got a Refractor, not an MJ. is Eric Strickland Refractor No rookies in this set of course Another No Protector Ray Allen It's a nice card But yeah, if you figure out the Centurions, um, you can figure out the pack production and actually see how many 
of the uh, base refractors and no protector refractors were produced of each player, which I haven't gone. I'll try to go over that in a future video so I can give you all the numbers and the production run, or at least a rough estimate. And we do have a mystery finest. Again, some people can tell based on the player. I cannot tell. I mean, I can see the player, but I don't have the cards memorized well enough. <clears throat> David Robinson, just base. to the protector there. Tracy McGrady. <clears throat> Only had one no protector. Those are one in four packs. We get roughly six per box. Now we got one in this pack. Not the refractor. Vinny, no protector. Jason Kidd. Jaron Jackson. Another kid. base in that pack. It'd be nice to hit a Centurion. Not easy to hit whatsoever. Or a nice refractor. A nice base refractor. A Dikembe on every one I've pulled has like missing part of the edge there. I don't know if that's it's gotta be a factory defect. You have a no protector, it's not the refractor. No, it is not a no protector. Okay, just stick into that. And no protector here. No, not it's a no protector. And back here. Travis Best, no protector. That's the second one, I th think. That we pulled. Uh, second or third. Shaq. don't know if you can get the checklist refractor. I've never pulled one before. And just base in that pack. So we're still expecting a couple more refractors based on the pack odds. like we have one and it's not who we're looking for. A David Wesley. Oh, cool. So we got a David Wesley and that peel is coming off. I'll probably just peel the rest of it off. And then this one is a refractor on that mystery finest. So that's pretty cool. Two Mystery Finest. Um, mystery Finest Refractor 1 and 133. Sh 
should be down to a no protector refractor and possibly a centurion's pull. There's a no protector regular, Chris Mills. Haven't gotten the base Jordan yet. There's our no protector. <clears throat> Again, not the player we're looking for. BJ Armstrong. Gorgeous cards. They refract on both the front and back. Those are one per box. So swing and a miss on the refractors. Haven't even pulled a MJ base yet. There's our first Iverson too, I think. Three packs to go. There's an MJ base. A no protector of Sam Mitchell. base in that pack. Last one. And nothing crazy in that. So I'll try to do this off camera real quick. Gotta be careful peeling these. Just in case you get a good hit. And not a real good sign, but Cavaliers. Sean Kemp. Not too bad. I'm not sure who's on the other side. Nice Kemp. Let's see if we can get the other side. There we go. M15 is the card number. Sixer, Tim Thomas. 
So not the best of refractor hits. Probably like a $5 card. Still cool to beat the odds. Let's go ahead and see if we can feel this one. had these before where I couldn't even peel them as well. I just left them. It can be tough sometimes. We got this one started. So Non-refractor. Alright, not a Jordan. M7, so Reef. Let's see who's on the other side. Well, I've got more boxes coming, so that side's being a little bit tougher. I'll show this card when I start another video. <clears throat> so not too bad, not the players we wanted, but we did beat the odds with this box break. Enjoy, guys, and we've got a few more boxes coming as well. Thanks, and have a good day.